favorite time of the year. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot to show the WWE Universe. We got zombies. Oh, and graveyards. And tombstones, both the stone and the underdeveloped eye. Hey, hey, his mic pack is showing. Mic pack, come on. Come on, man. Costumes and candies for all to enjoy. It's all here. So gather around and join us as we take a journey through the tales of the spooky. Mm, tales of darkness. Tales of things that go bump. goodness what's up everybody welcome back to the channel thank you so much for joining me once again and everything's gone interesting all right welcome back to the channel welcome to wwe 2k20 this is the first of the wwe 2k originals the bump in the night now this released yesterday and you are going to be seeing this on the 30th of october the day before halloween and i have something special coming out on halloween which is why I'm going to do this and the Demon Within today. First things first, though, we are going to do the Fear is Power Tower to unlock the Fiend. Uh, here we got six matches, um, all different kinds of brawls. We're going to be doing them all while playing as the Fiend. Bray Wyatt. Hello, Fireflies. Did you miss me? I am so glad you've come to join me today. Things are, well, a little bit different here right now. We're not in the fun house at all. Think of it as an adventure. Adventure is fun, right, Fireflies? Who's with me? I'm sorry you can't see me, but don't be scared. It's okay. It's a little dark around us, and as you know, we can't see in the dark. But he can. He can see the darkness all around us. Isn't that right, little fireflies? And sometimes, the only way to fight darkness is with darkness. And fight it we will. Our way. His way. So keep close to the sound of my voice, fireflies. He will clear out the darkness. He has work to do. All right. And there's Bo Dallas looking to make Bo Leavers out. Whoa. And on the other side, you have Bray Wyatt, who is transformed. Bray as the so fiend. Cool. So twisted inside. I don't even know what to say. And in this brawl, we have 20 minutes. He has zero all red health. And Bray, it's it's funny that he's taking on his actual brother, Bo Dallas. Get up. Get up, Bo. Come on. This is the Graveyard Brawl Arena. What a clothesline. The Fiend absolutely destroying Bre Bo Dallas here. Get up, Bo. Come on, get up. You can get up. I believe in you. I believe in you. Oh my gosh! Uh, we're just gonna pick up a bunch of tombstones. I hear this tower is fairly easy. I love how he's just ripping these tombstones right out. Whoa, uh oh. Back and forth. Back suplex. What a press. Bray Wyatt, of course, has had allies in the past. How does this game plan change being in this Sister match? Abigail dropping sure Bo it's Dallas. Experience in the ring should be an advantage. Now we're going to see. Abigail's been the last kiss goodnight for many WWE superstars. Bray the Manimal Claw. 
taking down Bo, and he's done. He's just completely done. That was really quick. <laughs> Now we're on two, which is Bray Wyatt versus Jake the Snake Roberts, the Fiend. The Fiend is going to be a very special part of our story coming up. Here we go. Oh, jeez. The Fiend, he's become more twisted and demented than ever before. And Bray with a back suplex once again. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. Big body slam. And now taking this tombstone once again. Oh, jeez. All right, Jake. I got you. Back Did you see that? Oh, come on. I reversed that. Fiend, Bray Wyatt, check his nose. Jake getting way too much offense in for my liking. He might have been on that one. Big suplex. Suplex. Corey Graves calls it. Bam. Oh my gosh, it threw him. Get up. Get up, Jake. You could do it. Oops. Oh. Targeting is kind of meh. Get up. Bam! Right in the face. Some talent for getting inside the heads of his opponents. How do you combat that in the ring? If by impressive you mean terrifying, then I agree with you. You have to stay focused and not let it be odd. Oh man, the smashing that tombstone over his head and the mandible claw, and he's done. Bray is just on a tear through all of this. Next, he's on Papa Shango. We got a few more after that. Papa Shango. Curse. Um, putting the curse on Ultimate Warrior back in the day. There's the bell, and here he is, the leader of the Wyatt family, Bray Wyatt. Here we go, fellas. And here we go, we got a broom. For quite some time. I think this is a broom, anyways. Oh, that's ow. Coming. That's not okay. Not again. One of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand. I'm literally right there. Oh, jeez. That one's countered. That was impressive, Michael. Ouch. Papa Shango with the offense. Now oh, trampling. Whoa, whoa, hold on, hold on, hold on. Lagging, lagging, lagging. Internet connection. Oh, again. Lightning fast reflexes. There we go. Trading the broom back and forth. Oh my gosh, how is he reversing all of this? Seems like we're back where we began, Michael. Done with that. What Float over DDT. DDT. Fight. Just throwing Papa Shango across the graveyard. Bam, right into the wow, face. Papa Shango showing that technical side. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. The Fiend. 
Just got Skip slammed. Slam. Papa Shango. And it's Bray Wyatt executing the reversal. Suplex. Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. And we here we go. Loves to take control of the match. Will he be able to do that here? Oh my Bringing God, we'll be seeing him take the fight wherever he wants. Tombstone. The ring or outside of it. Or outside the arena. Bray Wyatt has a history of luring oh, super getting out of his where the advantage is his alone. Hands. Oh, he knew that was coming. The Fiend now with the oh, back suplex on. once again onto Papa suplex. Shango. And Sister Abigail. Bray's Bray Bray just waiting. Now. Waiting for Papa Shango. Oh, Manable yes, Claw. Oh, how the heck is he not? The Fiend asking for him to get up. Bam! Right to the head. Knocking out Papa Shango. That is three, ladies and gentlemen. It's three done. We're almost there. And that was only 11 minutes. I forgot Kane was in this. Kane. All right. Bray Wyatt versus Kane. This is the simple way to do it. This is a way to use the big uh, tombstone. Bray Wyatt has a reputation for being unhinged, but with the emergence of his oh, what a clothesline! Fiend, he's become more twisted and demented than ever before. Grabbing that tombstone. And then Kane, one of the most intimidating opponents you can face. Oh, I'm breaking the tombstone right over his head. Strength. Incredible stamina and a fiery temper. You mess with Kane and you will get burned. The big book. Oh, oh what the heck? Oh, wait, wait. Setting up for a neck breaker. Uh oh. How? <laughs> wait a second. My game was lagging. That was not cool. Oh, okay, I can just go back to it. What the heck was that? My internet connection just cut out. And lagged the heck out. We're just going to keep it moving. Apologies for all the lag. The seemingly gentle Bray Wyatt is Oh, he started out with a signature. That's why. Taken by pure evil. But only the fiend. And then there's Kane, one of the most intimidating opponents you can face in the ring. He commands How did that... natural strength, incredible stamina, and a fiery temper. Wow. You mess with Kane and you will get burned. Right into the corner here. Come on, Bray, get up. Bray. Bray, can we have a conversation, Bray? Bray, Bray. Oh, jeez. Back and forth. Gotta go and grab me a tombstone after I take him out. Got him set for the what? He don't got me set for nothing. Ray Wyatt reverses it. Hit the mark with that one. Give me that tombstone. There's so many tombstones. More tombstones than an Undertaker Battle Royal. Oh man. Ray Wyatt doing some good work. Getting another tombstone. Oh, jeez. Kane with the reversal. Oh, it's Wyatt turning the tables. This is Neck breaker. Picking up that tombstone again. Ooh. 
dropping Kane. WWE history, but he can't afford to rest on his accomplishments in this match. What can Kane do to ensure the win here? The question for me the is Fiend what waiting for Kane, Kane to get up to ensure the win. Kane didn't earn multiple championships and the record for the most and a shot to the face. Rumble eliminations due to compassion for his fellow man. Sister Abigail, maybe. It's a nearly unmatched power. If Kane can get his glove around the opponent's throat, he'll be well on his way to victory. Kane getting up. Bray with the Manimal Claw. And knocking him out. Bray Wyatt got it done. Bray Wyatt taking him out once again. See? Not bad. Not bad at all. Now we got Sting, and I'm assuming Undertaker left. Sting 99. Give me a idea for how to do this next thing. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's lagging, lagging, okay. I'm using remote play to close this, and remote play isn't the best. Oh my god. <laughs> I want to use this book. Can I use this book? Oh, jeez. I think the book just disappeared. Not so fast. Back suplex. Oh, what the heck? How did he stand right back up? Bulldog. Oh, I have yellow health bar. Oh, man. Oh, man. Sting. Wyatt turning the tables. This is gonna be bad. What a nasty trip. What a big pump handle slam. Getting that tombstone again. Oh my gosh. Is anything here? Oh my gosh. The fiend. Oh, and he lands is absolutely it. Absolutely just destroying Sting. Well, what lag, lag, lag. The equation. It takes raw power from the stinger to lock that move in. Go after his arm. Oh jeez. The shoulder and that move may become too I don't know how he reversing everything with all this lag. In the stinger splash. Thing is far. From a one trick pony. Well, then oh, go for a back suplex. So he just reverses. And hope for the best. I wasn't saying it was going to be easy. Sting is in position. Oh, stop in the leg. Just nasty. Oh, wow. I can't believe that's his actual finisher. Look at the power of the sting. Oh, just drops him right behind him. All the lag. Work is being put in by Sting. Thing, just staring at the fiend. Just watching his every move. Oh, and that's the second time. You don't want to get hit with that once, let alone twice. And look oh, at what a close line. By Wyatt. The end is near. Oh no. Scorpion. No, he beat me. Okay. Does it sting captures the win? Alright. Let's try this again, shall we? We're gonna try this and hopefully there's not as much lag this time. The Fiend and Sting. The seemingly gentle Bray Wyatt has vanished completely taking him out. as this match begins, overtaken by pure evil, leaving behind only the Fiend. Then oh my god. Dedicates himself to justice, truth, and the destruction of evil. When the stinger sets his sights on something or someone, he becomes almost supernaturally unstoppable. Oh my gosh. 
Uh, frames. This is the only way that Sting is winning right now, or wins at all, is because of the fact that I have these issues. Anticipated that attack perfectly. Of the sounds. Oh, again. Get up, Sting. You can get up. I believe in you. Like a big vice grip. Clothesline. And he's hitting you with a clothesline because of detection, I guess. And water How? reversal from Sting. Knee right to the oh, I think he had that automatic reversal of whatever move I did. Are you gonna? Didn't do anything. Hooked him up. Back suplex. Angle, belly to back suplex. Grabbing the tombstone once again. This is some great off Bray Wyatt. Reversal. Big money Bray reversal. Back suplex oh, once nice again. That could be a game changer. Oh, what impact. Oh. Attacking harms Sting. Impact. And Sting slips out of harm's way. Whoa, it's another reversal. You know, Sister Sting Abigail. Bray Wyatt with the victory. Bray Wyatt wins against Sting. Even with all of the connection issues that are coming from the grave beyond. <laughs> so now, Bray Wyatt versus The Undertaker 91. This just makes sense. This makes all of the sense in the world. So this is the last match. Once you complete this, you unlock the Fiend in regular competition. It takes about 20 minutes to do. Oh, jeez. But with the emergence of his other self, The Fiend... Uh oh, wait, wait, wait. How does he have. Oh, it's a full on brawl from the beginning. How impressive was that reversal? Sister Abigail. Delivered by Bray Wyatt. Getting me my tombstone. Hey. Hey, Undertaker. I got a question for you. Have you ever been hit with a tombstone? Oh. Apparently not. Apparently not. Punch. Wow. Why was he... Why would he punch me like that? Hey, step ahead there. Great technical know-how on display. Oh, going for that back suplex. Oh, that'll leave a mark. The Undertaker. Why is he choking me out? Get him off, mate. Why is his offense doing so much? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We won't let me reverse. It didn't give me any any chance to reverse. All right. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to play this smart. We are going to have to play this smart. Don't really have much of a choice. A shot at the Undertaker is a shot at WWE. Oh, why can't I? Phenom is a far from average opponent. Oh, he has three finishers. How does he have three finishers? Resilience make him maybe the toughest competitor. How the heck does he have three finishers? And on the other side, you have Bray Wyatt. Center Abigail. So evil, so twisted. It's I, I don't even know what to say. I, I actually do. I think the phrase you're searching for, Byron, is Yowie Wowie. Yowie wowie indeed, Corey Graves. Get it? Your name is a pun on this. Many 
WWE superstars in the locker right. room today. I'm gonna hit you with one of my nanimal claws on the sole fact of I know I need to drive your health down a bit. Alright, give me a tombstone. The Undertaker is down in the field. Oh, jeez. He sat right up. Oh! I don't get how that worked. Oh jeez. It didn't even let it didn't even let me reverse. He he does so much damage. Wait, wait, I think I got it. I think I got it. No, I didn't. Oh, it's Wyatt turning the tables. This is gonna be bad. Back. Maybe? Why won't let me reverse anything? <laughs> Fall away, slam. Jeez. All he needs to do is hit me with a choke slam, and it's all over. And it's Bray Wyatt executing the reversal. Uh oh. That's not good. Oh, impressive counter. Sister Abigail, and he wins. Bray Wyatt, Bray Wyatt wins. Bray Wyatt wins it. Now we have unlocked the chaos at the crypt. We unlocked the tombstone and the fiend, as well as all the other fiend things. You see, what did I tell you? He took care of all those bad, bad people. He always does. And he does it for me. He does it for you. He does it because it needs to be done. And now we can all be together. Safe. Away from that darkness. The fun here never has to end. And remember my fireflies. I'll always light the way. All you have to do is let me in. Let Bye, goodbye, see you in hell. Bye bye. Okay. 150% increased attack damage, that's why it was like it was so hard. Okay. Okay, so I have to complete the demon within to get all of these. I already unlocked the fiend Bray Wyatt. And it's only fitting. Now at the end of this we take a look at the fiend's entrance so that being said come on wait for it the fiend Bray Wyatt Now we're going to take a look. I'm just going to put a random superstar here. Boink. Random superstar here. Okay. Just have him against Eric. Let's put him at a nice arena. We're gonna put him at the WrestleMania 35 arena. And here we go. We're just gonna take a look at the entrance. We're gonna finish off at the entrance of the Fiend, Bray Wyatt. I just put a random person, so we're just gonna see the entrance. Of the fiend. Here we go.
This has got to be one of the most frightening moments that we've ever experienced here. What in the world? It's not of this world, Saxton. It's supernatural. The worst nightmares of the WWE Universe have just been realized. This isn't a horror movie you can just turn off. The terror is real. Already, this has been How to Unlock the Fiend. Stay tuned for the the Demon Within Showcase, and stay tuned for the special Halloween thing I have planned. Stay tuned for more. Hit the thumbs up button. And that's already. I'll see you next time. Take care.